All right, so here's the plan. Wait. I have an idea. Since we're ghost hunting at 3 a.m., I thought, why not make it spooky and use this lantern I have? Well, that's my source of light for this video because I feel like it's creepy. Last thing before we hop onto the Oculus and start ghost hunting. You guys can get me to 5K subscribers before June 8th, which is my birthday. That would be greatly appreciated as a birthday present. All right, so as you guys can see, it is 3.03 a.m. You guys saw that it was pretty dark in my room. I'm not, like, lying or anything. I didn't change the time. We're going to play this creepiest part i feel like of doing anything at night is my windows are really like on big so i can hear like the, the crickets like the chirp 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 and all that so it's really gonna add to the experience especially since capuchin is a horror game now if video gets 500 likes i'll make a part two on like gorilla tag or something or i'll just play capuchin anyways we're gonna go straight into code venari and sing stuff on this. bro are you all right dog what are you saying? I'm probably going crazy. I am, right? I'm that weekend? Yeah, yeah, facts, facts, facts. My brother. Have you seen anything? Bro, what? I think I've seen stuff. You think? I think I've seen stuff. I don't know. I think bro hears voices in his head. Alright, now, maybe a shock to some, may not be a shock to others, but I'm gonna cut through this, because for a little bit, nothing happened, but a ghost did actually end up joining, which I think was kind of cool. So, we're just gonna cut straight to that. <laughs> Wait! He's actually playing the music. <laughs> bro's, bro's doing a jig. Bro, I think girl tag. Bro thinks it's girl tag. Bro killed himself. Bro sad enough. I'm stuck. I'm following bro. I mean, this is something, bro. Madeline, tiptoe. Yo, do you guys hear that loud noise? Yo, what time is it for you? Oh, it's 3 a.m. where I live. Oh, pal is pointing at me. Rut row. Rut row. Bro. Raggy. Yeah. I'm stuck. Right. Oh, he goes. So now, in the moment, I was like pretty tired because I had to stay up a long time to make this video. But looking back at it, he pointed at the little thing inside of there which i don't really know what that means but he did actually end up joining back so we're let's just cut to that it's the great return of tiktok it's the grand return oh it's over alpha oh <laughs> Marilyn. there goes mac come get me tiktok homie mac is gone don't get me, Tiptar. Tiptar, don't get me. Ooh. There he goes. He's going. <laughs> So, um, I'm just gonna pretty cut it short right there, because nothing really else interesting happens with Tiptoe. He kind of just walks around for the rest of this, doesn't point at anything else. Like, he goes on the board a little more, but he doesn't, like, point at anything else. But I would like to mention that it's a little weird that he pointed at Mac, and then Mac, like, left, because Mac apparently has been in there for, like, a really long time. But, um, yeah, and that's not the only scary thing. Actually, like, one or two other scary things did end up happening in this car. Oh, I've seen a monkey that's Wait, Ashley? I've seen a monkey then. Yeah, the Wait. same monkey though. Wait, what? Wait, no, this is getting creepy now. Maybe it's serious? Holding. What? I mean, there was no... I just seen a monkey, that's scary. That's actually creepy. Okay. Where did bro come from? You just came out of nowhere, pal. I, I joined the guy there. 
Yeah. Just oh, cool. it's another Australian, I think. Alpha. It's not Australian. It's New Zealand. No. Um, I believe that he thought he saw other ghosts, or he really did see like another character because um, he he was like kind of joking about Tiptoe not being real. So like, I I doubt that he tried to be like messing with me now if he wasn't trying to mess with me with Tiptoe. So that's why I believe that the first dude saw something. But that Venari, seriously, I did not see him leave Stump at all. Like I I. I did not see him leave Stump whatsoever. He literally just came behind that tree, which is a little odd. Anyways, the next, like, thing I'm going to show her, and the last thing is me just wandering around my code alone for a little bit, and that was, like, a little creepy to me, because, like, just playing games alone at night, like, especially games like Papuchin and Gorilla Tag, I don't know what it is, but, like, it makes it scary. Alright. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, what? Chat, chat, is this real chat? Is my code full at 3 a.m.? No, right? There we go. So it's just being weird. See, now I can join it. That's weird. All right, let's sit. In here. We're gonna sit in here for a few minutes. So I can creep myself out. Ugh. I just hate the feeling of being in codes alone, like all by myself. I feel like I'm gonna like trick myself into seeing stuff. But the scariest part is if something's actually in here, like messing with me. Know what I mean? Because, okay. So I got word from my friend like a while back. That there's people with no names in my code. So I'm actually genuinely, like, like, creeped out being in this code. Like, I'm not even gonna lie. I don't take, like, stuff like this right. You know what I mean? Especially when it's super dark in my room. I don't, I don't even feel comfort, like, taking my headset off. So it's, it's scary all around. I actually don't think I can handle another second of this. Now, I'm kind of mad at myself because I ended up going to bed after like a minute of doing this because I was like pretty tired. So, honestly, it was a pretty creepy experience at 3 a.m. Uh, seeing Tiptoe, um, that dude seeing a ghost, Venari, literally somebody named Venari coming out of thin air. And then also my code being full but then randomly not being full was also like very creepy because that's never happened to me before but that's gonna be the end of the video i hope you guys enjoyed and uh yeah let me know if i should do a part two